Thank you for all being here today. I want to specifically thank the members of the Santa Clara PAC who have spent days putting together this process. The PAC endorsed two years ago candidates that all fortunately were able to win their election. We're proud of that. The purpose of our PAC is to support candidates that we feel best represents the value of many businesses in the better Santa Clara area. These values include seeking individuals with different backgrounds and ethnicity. Last year we approached the Hispanic, Black, and Vietnamese Cambers looking for possible candidates. We did not get the interest we had hoped and we were not able to find candidates interested in serving the city through an elected position. In this case, we have Rod Duradon who's running for the city auditor and clerk. From this experience of not being able to attract other uh, possible candidates, we decided that we were going to add an educational portion to our presentation and endorsements. We felt by streaming these interviews, we'd be able to educate and interest future candidates for a good council position. The difficult times the city is facing, it's become more important to have individuals with business backgrounds to help the, make the right short and long-term decisions. For the candidates that we will interview today, and Rod's lucky enough not to be opposed, it is not intended to make this process difficult. Rather, we are hoping to make you aware of the problems and issues that face the city, specifically that affect business. Not all candidates decided to be interviewed through this process. To those that did not, we wish them well for other seats. If you do receive our endorsements because we best feel you represent the best business of Santa Clara, for those who do not receive the endorsement, we want you to know that we appreciate your efforts and applaud the facts you're involved. If you're elected, endorsed or not, we look forward to working with you. It's important to note the long history of the city and business in Santa Clara. It's one of mutual respect and common goals for the good of all Santa Clarans. We're relatively new to endorsing, and we want the process to be transparent. We want to provide the voters with information about the process and decisions we make. I wish to congratulate all of that chose to run and involve themselves with the city of Santa Clara, a decision you never regret.